The Nomos Tangenta's design was inspired by the Bauhaus School and the Werkbund, an association of German artists and designers. The watch became an instant classic when it was launched in 1991. The Tangenta is manufactured in the town of Glashütte in Saxony. Its success has helped this legendary watchmaking town polish up its image, which had faded during the communist days of East Germany. Roland Schwertner, a businessman from Dusseldorf, had the idea for the design. He founded the Nomos company in 1990. Since then, the firm has produced over 50,000 of the watches. We needed to find historical references in Glashütte. You can and should associate the new things being made in Glashütte with what came before. While looking through old books and documents on the history of Glashütte, we came across many exquisite pocket watches and complicated designs. But there were also sketches by A. Lange and Sons from the 1930s, which were more influenced by the Bauhaus era. They weren't designer watches, but rather low-cost, functional watches for export. The first drawing I saw of these watches made me feel almost sorry for them. They were just lying there, neglected in the books like an ugly duckling. I thought, maybe there's a swan hidden inside. So the basic idea behind this watch was, it would be really nice if only done the right way. Glashütte has been synonymous with world-class watches since 1845. Watchmaking continued during the communist era, but was mostly restricted to mass-produced models. Then came the fall of the wall, and in 1990, Roland Schwertner became the first to try to revive the town's traditional status. He started with just three employees and had to share his telephone line with a snack bar. For the first few years of production, Nomos purchased Swiss mechanisms. Today, the firm's 80 employees produce the watch and its alpha movement almost entirely themselves. The heart of the Tangenta, which sells for 920 euros, is refined with Glashütte specialties like three-quarter plate, second stop, Glashütte ribbing, and sunburst decoration. But here, too, form follows function. The construction of the Nomos Alpha movement is as straightforward as the watch's design. The mechanism functions very well, nothing superfluous. And because it has just a few parts, that solves all the technical problems. Because you have a movement that's very reliable and one that doesn't break down quickly. Special editions in colors like House Mouse Gray, Red Cross Nurse White, or Field Poppy Red led the Tangenta's simple design a playful note. They also give Nomos fans a reason to buy a new model. Artist Klaus Schmidt doesn't need any persuading. He owns 25 Tangenta models. For him, the watch is far more than a timepiece. Das Bewusstsein Put in a nutshell, it's like a modern-day form of humanism. Being consciously creative, relatively intellectual, it does away with embellishments, with the superfluous, and comes right to the point, while still having a human feel. Also, wird er kurz gefasst irgendwie eine aktuelle Form von Humanismus. Of course, we have to keep working on this watch and constantly improve it so it's not always the same thing. But I think there'll still be room for this aesthetic. That's the advantage of a classic. It doesn't become unfashionable. The Tangenta isn't trendy, but always remains modern. You could say it's timeless. <laughs>